Hey guys, on today's video, we're going to be updating your iPhone, iPad, or iPod Touch. The exact same instructions for all of them. Go directly into your settings. In your settings, your second option might say software update available. That's if you get that. It's okay if you don't see that. Right now, what you should do is click on your first option where you guys see your name or your device's name. And from there, just make a backup manually through iCloud. If you have no more space on your cloud, then just use iTunes or Finder on your Mac in order to make that backup. For PC, again, that's just iTunes. Also, if you're having any problems, you can also use iTunes or Finder in order to update your phones or iPads or iPod Touch. Anyways, we can scroll down, take a look at General. Under General, your second option will say Software Update. Under Software Update, we should see this popping up. This is actually really, really important. So you can download and install right now. If you guys just see Install, it's okay. It, depending on your settings, it might have already downloaded the update. So right now we're going to tap on download and update. It's going to ask us for a passcode if you have one. And then from there, it's just going to take care of this. This is pretty small and a pretty quick update. So don't worry about this taking too long. However, if you'd like to see more information, we can always tap on learn more. Right here in tiny letters, it's going to tell you about the security update and another link. For now, we're just going to have to wait those couple seconds to download and then install. Once it's installing, it's very important that your iPhone, iPad of touch does not turn off. While it's downloading, it's not a huge deal, but when it's installing, yes, because it could crash and then you might have to restore it. And that's why I always recommend making that backup just in case something bad happens. So even if you have 50% of your battery, I still recommend hooking up some electricity so that way nothing, nothing will ever happen when you're installing or downloading any updates. At this point, it's just going to prepare the update. So just about five minutes in, you will see this install now. So just tap on install now. It's going to verify the update. It's going to turn off your iPhone, iPad, up touch, and then we're almost going to be done. So right after, we're going to see an Apple logo in a loading bar. The first one's going to go kind of slow. And then the second time we see another Apple logo in a loading bar, it's going to go a lot faster. By now, it should be another five minutes, just about. And finally, we are all done with the update. We can check everything went okay. Just go into your settings and check once again in general software update. We should see that it's all up to date right now. We are done with this video. Anyways, if you guys have any comments, questions, you guys can write down here in the comments area. Don't forget to subscribe and rate. Thank you.